it makes us it makes the team better when it's me and him in the game and we get to play faster, you know, up and down. Don't have to bring the ball up every time. It's just whoever gets it can break it. So I think it helps out the team overall. Does he ever get mad when they call him a bulldog or anything? Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Devonte, on the eve before the first game, what's what, what are your emotions now? What are you feeling? Uh, I'm excited. Uh, we just had a pretty good practice, and you know now we're about to get it, go out here and practice in front of the fans. So uh, it's just an exciting time, you know, and try to not waste too much energy on just thinking about the game and thinking about the tournament. Are you? A are you an anxious guy by nature? I mean, can you can you make it through tonight and tomorrow and relax without worrying about it too much? Uh, I think I can. You know, uh, for the next couple of hours, I think I'll be a little excited. You know, but then when, once I get a good nice rest and wake up in the morning, then it's just gonna be like a regular schedule. Uh, we still taking yourself back to that Oklahoma game when Frank fouls out. What was going through your head when he? When Frank fell out and you knew you, know, you were going to be that guy for the final however many minutes that was. Uh, it's crazy because I was just real confident. I had a lot of confidence in myself, man. And, uh, and the first thing I told him was, I got you. Like I wasn't gonna let, wasn't gonna let the team down. Don't feel like, I, cause I seen it on his face. He seen, it seemed like he had a little sense that he let the team down because he had just fallen out. So I just told him, you know, I got you. I got the team, and, and then I just tried to do what I could to help us win. Did something change for you in that game? I mean, I know you've always had confidence, but you know, coaches talked about it was maybe hard for you to to defer. Or you wanted to defer to the older guys just because it's their team and they're the upperclassmen. Did something change with you in terms? about your mindset or was it just getting that opportunity? Like, uh, I don't think it was just that game, you know, I just had a pretty good game that game, but the whole the whole season, you know, I've just been coached and the guys especially, they just been telling me, you know, you got to be more of a leader and stuff like that, so I think throughout the season it's just been growing on me, and growing, growing my leadership has just been growing. So much of success in March is determined by guard play, and you guys, I mean, there's not a, probably a better duo or trio. How do you guys feel now going into this? I mean, is there added pressure? We feel good, you know. We, it's no pressure. Coach won't. Coach keep preaching. Uh, don't get into the pressure. You know, it's no pressure. You guys have been playing free and lose, having fun. You know, you just got to keep that same mentality and confidence, and just go out and have fun. So I don't think it's. I don't think it's any pressure. You know, it's it might be. People might feel like it's pressure that we need to win. We haven't won past the first week in the last two years, and. And maybe that might get to some people, but I think if we play how we've been playing, uh, we should be pretty fine.